And yes, folks, another day means yet more technology here on Tech of Tomorrow. I'm Eric, your host, and today we're going to be taking a look at a product from the people over at ASUS. This is the PA249. Now, this is part of their Pro Art series. This is a 24 inch monitor, 1920 by 1280 resolution. But the big thing about this is all of its color matching technologies. It's got all kinds of things with Adobe and stuff, such as you're printing or doing pictures. It's going to match those colors precisely before you print them out. It's also got just all kinds of things that are geared towards that stuff. So today we're going to go ahead and unbox this thing, do the overview and see what the PA249 is all about. So with that said, let's jump in, let's check out the box and then see the features of this monitor. Let's go. All right, folks. So first off, like usual, any unboxing, got to show you guys the box. Asus, inspiring innovation, persistent perfection. These guys have won an award 2013 for a great design from Red Dot. You guys can see that right there. Also, you can see it's the Pro Art Series LCD monitor, PA249, Adobe RGB match, IPS, AHIPS monitor, ultra wide view angle, LED backlit, 1920 by 1200 resolution. Color accuracy of AE3. You also have precision factory calibration, which means from the factory, it's already been calibrated to a professional level for using in the industry. Features four USB 3.0 hubs and basically 10 times the connectivity of most monitors. So we'll flip it around, just let you see the side. Flip it around, let's see the other side. Not much to it, except for showing you that the monitor can be, you know, used in multiple ways. And the last side of the box. So I'll spin it around here, take my little trusty knife here, Make a little incision here. Make another one across the board. One more. And ba bomb. We'll open the box up so everybody can see together. Dun 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 dun. All right, here we go. It's a little fortress. We can hide inside together and escape the bad people. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. All right, so check it out. We've got the power cord coming at you, cameraman. <laughs> Then we've got the PA249 installation series little guide here. No, this is just the driver's CD. I'm just messing with you folks. For some monitors, it'll be plug and play. If you want, you can install these drivers. Might do something, might not. Cameraman, it's all you. We got the ASUS VIP member notice. Oh, I'm now a very important person. I've been notified of my membership. Uh, that means I'm in a gang. We've got to come up with some like cool new gang sign. You know, I don't know. They've all been taken, so it's going to be hard to do. So that's that. Cameraman, all you again, baby. Woo! All right, what do we got here? Lots of more stuff here. It's in Russian. Uh, oh, wow. Transylvania language. Uh, I dropped a little thing here. Let me get to grab down here. See my head? Whoop. Well, what do we got here? Take back services. A Zeus recycling and take back program come from our commitment to the highest quality standards. So if you have any problems, you're probably going to want to take a look at this and use that link. I can't toss it. The camera is too light. It just wouldn't go anywhere. And then we've got this right here, which is their series LCD monitor quick start guide. Just tells you all the connectivity on the side, which we're going to go over anyways. It's in multi languages. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Uh, let's see your cable ties. These are nice to have. Check these out. They're not like a tie you can wear on your chest, but they're a cable tie. So you can get all your cables out of the way of your desk when you're setting everything up. And that's nice and good to have. That I can toss the camera in and will. Then we've got more cables. This one right here is the DVI. What else does she come with? Display port cable. I've got one of those. Standard display port cable. DVI cable. Here's standard little VGA cable. And a USB 3.0 connectivity cable for those USB connectivity things. So let's let's share these all with the cameraman. <laughs> Scared him that time. All right, here's your color calibration testing report. Tells you all the grayscale, all the gamma values, Adobe RGB, sRGB, average delta, all that stuff comes inside there. That's that. We got another big cardboard thing in here. See if I can get it out of here. Arr. Can I get it out of here like a pirate? Jeez. Come out of there, you bleeding blarmy monitor box. Oops. I think I broke it. No, I didn't. All right, well. All right, so I crack the little foam a little bit. Sue me. Yeah, you thought I was going to throw that at you, Cameron, didn't you? Yeah. You had that look of anticipation on his face. He's like, hell no. 
All right, so now this is cool. They come with a stand on it. Oops. All right, folks, so here I pulled it out of the box, and this time I will not hit the microphone like I did last time. It's all set up. So let me just go ahead and hand this box back to the camera without trying to destroy the whole house. And there we go. All right, teamwork. So let me go ahead and pull this thing out, set it down, and begin getting it naked. Dun, 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 dun. Let's spin this thing around. La do da do da. Now check this out though. Right at the bat, folks, you guys can see this thing moves around quite a bit. I mean, really, quite a bit. AH IPS screen, 24 inch, Pro Art series, 1920 by 1200 resolution. I think in the beginning I might have said 1280. I don't know if I did. Excuse me, I just made a foo pas there. Um, all the rest of the features are kind of here, except for some of the advanced ones, which we'll get into. This monitor has lots of control here on the front. You guys can see everything's very easy to access right here on the right hand side of the front panel, all from your power to other things. We'll go ahead and flip the monitor to the side. You guys can see the monitor is very thin. It says designed by Asus in Taiwan right here on the side. So now let's take a look at the monitor's connectivity. Like this thing has connectivity for almost any type of connection. We're going to start from the left hand side where we see the power button. Then we see the power cable. Then we're going to switch over to the right hand side where we see the display port, the HDMI, the DVI, standard VGA, sound, and then the USB uplink cable. Now let's move on and let's go take a look at some other parts of the monitor. Right here on the side, you guys can see are the four USB connectivity ports. So it has high speed USB 3.0. Now let's actually talk about some of the very unique features about this monitor. So now let's talk about some of the features that we didn't talk about while we're just showing you guys the monitor. The monitor has a 16 by 10 aspect ratio. It has 0.27 dot pitch, six millisecond response time, has seven splendid modes, four color temperature modes. It also features a very wide color gamut and reproduces 99% of the Adobe RGB color space. With this technology, the colors seen in photos will be reproduced faithfully and consistently in a way that cannot otherwise be on monitors with just an S RGB color space. The monitor also features 10-bit color for smoother gradations. The PA249Q offers 10-bit display color for over 1 billion on-screen colors and support for 12-bit internal lookup table, the LUT, which gives smoother gradients and a more natural transition between color hues. The monitor comes pre-calibrated right out of the box. This has been done to minimize the color difference to delta E of less than three, ensuring precise reading of color input and guarantees excellent color fidelity. It also features a next generation AHIPS advanced high performance in-plane switching display technology. This is made for superior color technology, a brighter image from increased backlight transmission and lower power consumption. Each PA249Q also features a brightness rated at 350 CD to M2 and an 8000 to 1 Azu Smart Contrast Ratio for enhanced image contrast. The PA249Q has a five-way navigation key that acts as a joystick, and it also gives access to the Quick Fit Virtual Scale function along with all the other OSD functions and settings. You also get picture-in-picture -picture and picture-by-picture -picture technology. This allows users to view images from different signals in almost every way they want. PIP and PHB lets users view images from different signals and lets them switch between the main and PIP course, including audio, easily. ASUS also includes the Quick Fit Virtual Scale function, which is included in the PA249Q. This allows users to review photos and documents on screen in their actual sizes prior to printing. It can be activated via a hotkey on the monitor and uses a guide to accurately view and edit photos. Additionally, the PA249Q also comes with a choice of seven different background colors for users to choose from. So there you guys have it, folks. I mean, the PA249Q has a lot of features, and it's not just for your average gamer guy. This monitor is meant for the Soho or business user who has to rely on color accuracy being the most important thing about their monitor. With all the features that are built into the PA249Q, it's made for those type of people who are gonna be using it to edit photos, edit videos, and really have to have color matching as an important aspect of their day. 
For a gamer, it's overkill because this monitor costs about $509. But if you're somebody who needs those important features and you don't want to have any kind of sacrifice, this monitor is really a kick-ass product for those type of people. So we'll see you later. We're going to hook this monitor up in another video and show you how it functions. But for now, this is the unboxing and overview. Thanks for watching.